Hi guys, and I am back. So we're gonna continue on with Resident Evil Village. Hopefully this is the final stretch of the game. Just in case. I didn't really exit the game, I just left it here for a Preparation is more time. important now than ever before. Amat Victoria Koram. Hell is that? its end. How about some reckless spending to finish it off? Oh, the assemblage of life and machine. I can feel Lord Heisenberg's essence through it. are more dexterous than one might think. All right. Please, be well. Thanks. We're going to continue on. Hopefully. I mean, I think we'll get dead inventory down here. Duke's Emporium has everything you need for your decisive battle. Thank you for your purchase. This may be our last meet. This will be my... My last time watching you walk away. There was a chest around here. Where is it? Oh wait, no, that was at a different spot. I think. Fuck it. Who cares? Who cares? No. Out of my way. Oh, it's in a different spot, I think. daughter come to me is that you oh how I've missed you 
What? <laughs> My power is leaving me! Rose! Miranda! Interesting. Your body certainly isn't normal. Give Rose to me. Now! You will see. Once I kill you properly, everything. Get her now! Let go! I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me.
Then wake up. Chris. Ethan. He did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan. We gotta move. I'm in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. Uh, hey. Uh, uh, uh. Tell yourself. Oh, come on, it's not that much further. Watch over. Her. Teach her to be strong. God damn it. Goodbye, Rosemary. Take us up now! going on.
Look down. What have you done? He's gone! I tried. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Captain. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. The hell were they thinking? What the hell? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSA at Europe HQ. Someone's gotta pay. Resident Evil Village. Wild fucking ride, that's for sure. So more, in turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. The burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, Monty.
A green screen messed up. Green screen is moving up. Their, uh, my uh, fan is probably moving the damn screen. As I know, there aren't any multiple endings for this game. If I find out there are, I'll play through it again on a harder difficulty. Uh, but as far as I know, there aren't any. You never know, though. Uh, there's not much else you can do. I mean, there wasn't too many important uh, choices at all. It was very linear, so straight ahead. Probably no way to change the ending, though. I don't mind. I like the ending, but I didn't like the fact they killed Ethan off. <laughs> Hopefully he's not dead. But he probably is. So, I don't know who's going to be the protagonist of Resident Evil 9 now. It's either going to be Chris Redfield, which is kind of overpowered in my opinion, or Rose or Mia. can touch the moon is too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cool. You were being silly. I <laughs> don't think the moon is you <laughs> That's Ethan's Jack. I was wondering why I saw Adult Rose as one of the, uh, in the cast. I'm sure that's Rose. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. I love you.
Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. <sighs> Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know. I know. <laughs> and what does this take place like? Uh, like at least twenty years later, or sixteen? Years later? Huh. Father's story is now done. Okay, difficulty casual, completion time, 8 hours and 41 minutes and 52 seconds. <laughs> Unlock content in the bonus menu. The following has been added to the bonus menu. Extra content shop, concept art, figures, and challenges. Alright, challenges and extra content shop. Blah, blah, blah. Complete challenges listed in the challenges menu in order to receive completion points. CP can be change for a variety of bonuses in the extra content shop. New game mode, weapons, concept art, figures, etc. Okay, new movies added. The following movies have been added to the movies in the bonus menu. Village of Shadows full version, creating of the Village of Shadows, the level design of Resident Evil Village, the visual development of Resident Evil Village, the visual production of Resident Evil Village. You can now get the following weapon from the extra content shop for finishing the main story. WCX, whatever that is. Well, that was it. That was Resident Evil Village. Overall, I think it was actually a pretty damn good game. The only issue I have to take with it, besides the fact they killed Ethan off, but that's fine. I mean, uh, if they're going that route, that's a, that's perfectly understandable. Uh, was it was dark enough for me? <laughs> it wasn't scary enough. I mean, the the only thing it was real good action horror, uh, but. It didn't completely feel like action survival horror. It just felt like it didn't feel as scary as Seven. That's what really kind of annoyed me because I really like Seven. I wish they topped it in that way. Um, so the game itself was excellent, except for that. Uh, I really wanted it to be a little darker, a little scarier, and a little more intense. It was tense in the sense of like tense situations, but not tense horror situations to me. Uh, mostly tense action situations. There's a few pop-up scares, but that was it. Uh, but the game itself, action-wise, was great. The, uh, the characters were, were excellent. The story was phenomenal. So, I really hope they go this direction with Resident Evil 9, but I really hope that with the next Resident Evil, they kind of go back slightly and make it kind of freakier. Especially since we're playing with a younger female character. Um... Uh, that's new to like scary situations, but I don't know anything about Rose, so you never know. She might have uh, powers or something, or a regeneration. 
she might play completely different, who knows, because they said she was the apex of what, um, Evelyn's design, so she said she had powers. Anyway, I will see you guys next time, you guys take care, and peace out for now. Thank you for watching. If you guys like what you see, remember to add me. Uh, I pretty much put up videos every, uh, every day, or every, every few days. Anyway, you guys take care now. Peace out.